Hi, my name is Amanda Wilson. I'm the Mayor of Holfast Bay. I'm down here, down at the Broadway Beach today because we're doing a small cultural burn in the lead up to Proclamation Day. This Proclamation Day on the 28th of December, we're going to be having fire signals along the beach at Holfast Bay. This is the first time we would have been doing that. Uh, we have a big information session coming up for people if they're interested. It will be at the Brighton Civic Centre on Monday the 27th of November at both 4 and 6.30. Jump onto our website if you want to know more about the whole signal fires or attending this special event. At last night's council meeting, we agreed upon looking at a new construction hoarding policy with all the amount of construction going on in Jetty Road, Collie and around Mosley Square at the moment. We want to have hoardings that reflect the high level of aesthetics that we require of Holfast Bay. And so the council administration is putting that together at the moment. The Art Deco Policy Review also came back to Council where we've been analysing what buildings fit the statutory criteria for those that can be acknowledged as Art Deco buildings. Those findings will be on our website and you're welcome to have a look at them. The findings from the review can then be applied to the Planning and Development Code uh, so that we can have greater protections over our heritage buildings. Council's also undertaking a review of informal sports infrastructure around our city, things like soccer nets, basketball courts, and see which ones need to be upgraded or supplemented. There's 11 sleeps to go until the Glenelg Christmas pageant, which is on Sunday the 26th of November. And we're inviting everyone down there to wave at all of our local community groups and traders who will be participating in the parade. And then there's a chance to meet Santa at the end.